Hey guys, welcome to Technical Period here. Today in this video, I'll be talking about one of the best PDF application for your iPhone. I recently came across this application. It's the best and great application for PDF editing as well as the PDF files. So let's start the video and open the application. So here, if you go to App Store, the application name is I Love PDF. So many people must be knowing about this. Those who don't know, it's a good thing for you. So if you see here, let's open the application and go through it. So once you open the application, here is the UI or the home page about the application. And here the multiple tabs like your file, tools or a scanner as well. It's a great thing. Wow. And setting. So let's go one by one and check out. Talking about the files folder, there are two options on my iPhone or iCloud just like your files application. And here you can choose or you can add any file as per your choice. Okay. Just tap on the plus icon and choose the location like your files application or camera roll or camera itself. Alright. You can choose the file and add it here just like this one. If you see it is a PDF file. Okay. And we can view it here. And now about editing the PDF file. We will see later. First let's see about the other tools here. If you see here. Second option is your tools. Right. And if you see there are multiple tools available for your PDF editing here. Okay, taking from your image to PDF or conversion, compression, etc. Okay, there are multiple tools for PDF. As you can see here, compress PDF, okay, split the PDF, okay, organize the PDF, okay, watermark, etc. etc. Talking about tools here, almost all tools are free except certain tools like conversion tools like your PDF to Word, Word to PDF, or PDF to PowerPoint, Excel to PDF. Okay, such conversion tools are paid comes with the premium version for example if you see here okay pdf to word or a word to pdf it is a paid or a premium version other than that all the basic tools required to edit the pdf are completely free like your watermark or you can edit the pdf or you can sign the pdf or compress the pdf so here let's try the compressing or a organizing the pdf here for example if you see organize the pdf so basically what is organize the pdf so organizing the PDF means we can rearrange the page numbers or pages as per our choices. Okay, let's choose the file and if you see there are three pages here and let's organize them or reorganize them. So now let's make page number two as a page number one. Okay, just hard press and swipe it. If you see, okay, like this you can do here. Similarly, there are many other tools which are completely free for you to use. For example, let's try okay, watermark. So you can add a watermark to your PDF file completely free. For example, let's try watermark and here if you see, okay, here you can choose the file first and now go back here and here you can enter your text as a watermark. Okay, choose or customize your watermark as per your choice. Okay, position, the size, length, everything you can be done here. Also, you can add a image as a watermark for your PDF file. Okay, completely free. Well, these tools are really great and good. Now comes the main question that is how to edit the PDF. So for that, go to your files option and here open the PDF file to edit just like this one. Okay, here is the PDF file. So now how to edit in this file on top side, tap on a pencil icon. Just tap here. Once you do that, it will open a PDF editing menu or a sidebar and there are multiple tools available here. Okay, taking from your entering text, entering image, okay, drawing, erasing, etc. etc. Here. So now for example, let's tap on the picture icon or image icon and insert the image. Okay. It will take you to camera roll. Choose the image and just choose the quality to enter and just insert the image in a PDF file. It is so easy here and faster. Similarly, there are many other tools available to edit the PDF. Okay, you can use them to edit the PDF. So for example, eraser, etc. You can use it to edit the PDF, right? So now let's try other things. So once you finished editing the PDF, there are other tools as well. For example, if you see, click on or tap on three dots, okay, to access the PDF editing tools, okay, the main features. If you see here, these are tools which can be accessed within a PDF file itself to edit it. So if you want to rotate the PDF file, or you can, if you want to enter the page numbers or if you want to enter the watermark within a PDF file, you can do it here through these options. So these are all the options available in a single application for you. So in a simple words, everything is available to edit the PDF in a single application. 
so guys talking about this application there are many features about this application which can be useful for your pdf editing you can download it and explore the application until then if you like this application please give a like and please subscribe for more awesome videos on iphone tips and tricks and iphone customization until then thank you very much bye bye take care